Today, we have one billion vehicles on the road. If the developing economies continues to grow in the same way, by 2050, we will have a world with two billion cars. The Ohio State University has the mission of assisting the automotive industry in producing cleaner, more efficient, and safer cars. So we're looking at electric, hybrid vehicles, advanced batteries, alternative fuels, anything that can remove the need for using petroleum from tomorrow's automobiles. The Ohio State University started racing electric vehicles and developed the Buckeye Bullet, hoping to break records that are currently held by vehicles powered by internal combustion engines. Mr. Pastor of Venturi made contact with us and made it possible for the team to go to Bonneville and set the records. At Venturi, we set ourselves an objective, to be the company that develops the fastest electric vehicle in the world. To do this, we hooked up with OSU, which is a very big American university, to develop a program and to test our components here on the Salt Lakes of Bonneville. Today, land speed racing gives us the opportunity to push technology to its limit. But tomorrow, these batteries will be improved for everyday electric automobiles. That's it, we got the world record. Today, the electric vehicle can overtake the most polluting technology, the internal combustion engine. The important point for this small Monaco company that I manage is to bring solutions to the city of tomorrow, which must become cleaner. We wanted to develop a vehicle which has in its DNA all the innovations we were able to develop for this record. It's a clean vehicle, which sends a strong message about the future of the automotive industry. It makes me very proud to present this vehicle to the press. I think it's one of the key vocations of the principality to show the way in terms of the environment, so this city of tomorrow can offer an even better quality of life for us and for our children.